Hey guys, David here, back with our day seven in our workout series. Today we're gonna to incorporate using some bottles. We're gonna do another six minute on, 30 seconds off. We have six movements for you to complete today. The first movement, we're gonna do, take two water bottles. You're gonna start with a lunge to a touchdown and then a lunge to a tee. So lunge, touchdown, to a lunge tee. And then you're gonna to switch to the other leg, lunge, touchdown, into a lunge tee. And then you'll swap back and forth between each leg for the entire minute. You'll do each leg twice, touchdown T, swap legs, touchdown T. Okay, you ladies ready? And I have Harley and Lauren helping us, two of our athletes that have worked with us <coughs> today. So we're gonna start with one minute on and 30 seconds off. Ready? And begin. Yep, good, just like that. T and touchdown. Make sure we're keeping our chest up. Not lunging out too far, just make sure we're controlling the down and the up. Good. Alternating between that. Touchdown, good. T, good. Keeping that chest up all the way through it. Very nice. Keep it going, ladies. Good. Good. You ladies are halfway done. Keep it up. Almost there. 30 seconds left. Remember, the water bottles don't have to be too heavy. Two tiny ones will do. It's just to add a little bit extra into the workout. Good. 20 seconds left. Good, take your time, breathe through it. 15 seconds. Remember the goal is not to go as fast as possible, it's just to be able to go the entire minute. Five seconds left, ladies. Good, all right. Now the next workout that we got is gonna be, you're gonna take just one water bottle, start in a completely locked out position. From there, you're gonna take the bottle, Come all the way up, circle it around your legs. Come all the way back down, leaving your feet together the entire time. Up, circle around, back down. Up, circle around, back down. All right, here we go, ladies. You ready? And go. Up, circle, back down, good. Up, circle, back down, good. So this will give you a little second grace period being on the ground that you can have some active recovery after the first workout that we just did. So we're activating that core, lifting all the way up using that bottle, circle around the legs, come all the way back flat. Good job, ladies. Keep it up, make sure you breathe through it, control that heart rate. There you go, keep those legs as straight as possible. Remember the goal is to be able to do it for the entire minute. So as you start to get tired, it starts to burn, just slow down a little bit, breathe in deep, and then try to keep going. Less than 30 seconds left, you're doing great, ladies. Good, good. Come on, 20 seconds left. Keep it up. You're almost there. Make sure you're breathing deep. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Control that heart rate. Good job. Come on, 10 seconds left. Let's go. Keep it up. There you go. Keep it up. Almost there. Great job, ladies. Great job. All right, the next movement is going to involve both water bottles. We're going to complete a thruster. So you're going to... Water ball is nice and tight inside your shoulders. You don't want it to be out here. So you're working more of the uh, outer part of your deltoids. You want it to be nice and tight in here. Squat, press, squat, press. Keep your chest up the entire time. Press the water balls all the way to an extended position, covering your ears. Here we go, ready ladies? And go, squat, press, squat, press. In your squat, make sure you're trying to go around that parallel marker down here, keeping that chest up. Don't drop your chest in between it so you can have that good, nice thruster when you come back up. This is just like a press through extension. Good job. Good, keep those elbows in nice and tight as we come up. Good squat, keep it going. This is our third movement, so we're halfway there after this one. 30 seconds left, keep it up ladies, come on. There you go, breathe through it. Good. Good, keep those feet shoulder width. Make sure they're right outside your shoulders with your toes pointing slightly out as you come down. Make sure you're getting a good, nice squat stance. Almost there, 15 seconds. Good, less than 10 left. Great job, ladies, great job. All right, now everyone have a seat. Next workout is gonna take place on the ground. You're gonna need both the water bottles for us. So you're gonna open them to a nice straddle, put the water ball side in front, 
and you're gonna focus on three leg lifts each side with the water bottles. So right hand's gonna stay in the middle, left hand, one, two, and three. Then the other side, one, two, and three. Ready, ladies? Here we go. And begin. One. There you go, good. Three each side. And then you're swapping hands and swapping the ball. If it falls down, no big deal. Pick it right back up, keep going. Swap sides, we're doing three reps for each leg. Swapping each time, last for the entire minute. Keep it up, ladies, keep it up. There you go. Make sure to breathe through this. Gonna focus on building those hip flexors out, creating more extensiveness in your jumps. 30 seconds, ladies. Good, keep it up, keep it up. There you go, there you go, good, good reps. Fifteen seconds left. Come on, we're almost there. Good. We only got two more exercises after this. Good. Five seconds, y'all. Good job, good job. All right. Now, take both the water bottles. You're going to put them in the center. Step to one side. We're going to do a burpee to jump over the middle of the bottles back to the burpee. So you're going to go down. Make sure you're going all the way down to the floor. Come back up. The jump is gonna be over the bottle, down, hips to the floor, come back up, back over, and repeat. Here we go, ladies, ready? Five seconds. And begin. Perfect, good, y'all. And hop over, great job. This is our fifth movement of all of our six. So this one, we have one more. There you go, good, Harley. Good. Breathe through it. Pop yourself up. Good. 40 seconds left. There you go. There you go. Push through it. If it falls down, pick it right back up. Keep going. Halfway there, y'all. Halfway there. Come on. Push through it. Push through it. There you go. Keep it up. Keep it up. You guys got 20 seconds left. You're doing good. Come on, y'all. 10 seconds left, almost there. Great job, great job. All right, last one we got. This is gonna take both your water bottles. You're gonna go down to a plank position. Get right in front of the bottles as you come here. Feet shoulder width apart, grab the bottle, lift it over your head. Go to the other side, bottle, lift it over your head. Bottle over your head. Bottle over your head. Here we go. Make sure you're holding a nice plank. Don't stick your butt too high in the air. Squeeze that core as you come through and lift it all the way past your ear. Here we go. And begin. There you go, great job. Breathe through it. Make sure you're controlling your heart rate. Good, y'all, good ladies. This is our last movement. Great job. Good, push through it. As you start to wear down, remember this is our sixth movement, so go slower if you need to, but try to uh, remain doing it the whole minute. We have 30 seconds left. Come on, you guys can make it. Good. Breathe in deep, exhale deep. 20 seconds, ladies, come on. We're almost there, y'all. Good, 15 left. 10 seconds. Good. And breathe. So that was one round. I challenge you guys, challenge you guys to do as many rounds as possible. You can use your phone as your timer or you can just replay the video and do it again. Great job.